So the teams will line up. Recording camera one. Looks like the dark blue is USA going up towards the grandstand. Italy in the lighter blue coming out of the pile and heading towards the jumbo trail. That's their end. It looks like Matteo is on the attack very quickly. Mini covering him. Now Mini going for the back end. Gets a little touch down anticipating it. The pony going a little backwards on him. Needs to get some control. Jimmy Deang just picks it up, turns it around with a couple of nice taps. Find Sophia, Sophie, Sophie. What's going on at the moment? Who's got the ball? It looks like Mateo's trying to turn it, trying to get through the pack. It's a bit of a melee going on at the moment. No one getting a clear shot at goal. Jimmy Deang just turns it brilliantly, gets past Minnie, goes for the shot at goal. It looks pretty good. It's got the legs, but it didn't quite have the direction. And it runs out over the back line. So we'll have a hit in to the USA, looks like the number four. Sam Clemens will be taking it. Sam on that great pony, I believe that's Snowbird. Taps across the face of his goal. Dangerous play in this bouncy field, but he gets a lovely pass away to Mini. Mini picks it up, riding army. Can Mini get another shot? Yes, she can. It's going well wide. She's going to have to get into the middle somehow. Little backhand towards the middle, not far enough. Backhand from Marco Elsa. Picked up by Jimmy DeAndres, well anticipated by the number four for Italy. Trying to get away from Dan Keating, he's trying to hook him. He's still going well. Dan Keating gets the backhand. Anybody turning who's anticipating first looks like Marco Elsa. Marco tries to put it towards the middle, picks it up. Matteo picks it up. Sam Clements thought he might have the line, but he didn't. And the umpires correctly let that go. And now the ball's fallen to Marco, Marco Elsa. In control, we can get the next shot. That's all right, Sophie the answer. Sophie is heading towards the goal. Sam Clements rides her out of the way and then ushers the ball over the back line. Had a chance to play the backhand, but would rather let it run over the back so he can have the forehand shot at it. So Italy have to be 30 yards into the field of play, give Sam enough room to make the play. Taps the ball out, Sophie's gonna foul him by doing that. He can't come around across Sam's line. So the main foul, the one that's called most often, is the line of the ball, which basically is the direction in which the ball is traveling. If you are traveling on your horse on that same line, before or after it, you have the right of way to the ball, basically. Anybody crossing that line will create a penalty. So Sam had tapped the ball out towards the side. Sophie came from the middle and went across the line to try and get to it. And the umpires called the foul. Mind you, it was close because Sophie, you know, you could have said she had time to make that play. It wasn't a danger. So Sam needs to keep an eye on that. He's going to have to hit the ball in a little quicker because Sophie's obviously going to be attacking him, which is a good tactic by the Italians. Don't give Sam time to settle into his game is what they're thinking. So the number four, Sam, on Snowbird, gets the pass towards Dan Keating. That's looking inviting for Dan. But uh, Matteo gets the backhand, and Sophie read it well. Mia, uh, Minnie going across with her. Minnie gets a lovely near side backhander right into the middle of the field. Peter Freeman trying to pick it up, and as you saw, we had Jimmy DeAngelis coming down the line of the ball, and Peter just coming in right in front of him. And so the umpires blow the whistle for the infringement by Peter Freeman. Now the Italo Italians will get a chance to have a penalty shot. And we'll see what Rory's going to do. I think it's probably going to be from the spot. Yes, it is. And Jimmy DeAndres will take the penalty. He's just walking up. Look at that. Very relaxed, very easy. Tries to get the ball to Marco. Marco standing on it. Dan Keating trying to get to it. Sophie's pony having a couple of kicks. Gives her the near side backhander. Peter Freeman trying to get to it. I think he got a little touch. Can he get another one? Yes, a good under the net. Oh, well played, Sophie. Unlucky for her, runs into Marco. It's there for Dan, or for Peter. Dan going with a lovely strong backhand towards the middle. Minnie running at speed. Look at her go. Oh, she just gets hooked out. Brilliant play by Jimmy DeAngelis, but Peter Freeman keeps the attack going. Jimmy misses that. Peter's got a real chance here. He just backs it into the middle. Sophie trying to clear it. Oh my goodness, somebody get a just anybody get a touch on that ball. And I think, oh gosh, the Italians get the first touch, but Peter Freeman sends it back in the middle. Well played the number one Italian, Sophie. She gets the backhand. Sam Clement sends it right back into it. Hits his own man, Dan Keating. 
then Mateo gets a little neck shot away. Dan Keating sends a strong backhand. They're keeping good pressure on the Italian goal at the moment. Jimmy DeAngelis going for a cut backhand. Very nice indeed. Mateo on the near side just evades the hook from Minnie. Gets the second shot. Can he get the third? Yes, he can. Now he's not going to get a fourth because Minnie's going to take him out. Minnie needs the backhand. She didn't get it. Sam Clements is there with the backhand. Runs into a pony. Can Keating? No, he can't because Mateo gets there first. Puts it in front of Marco. Can Marco cut it? No, he can't. Keating needs the backhand. He gets it. Who's anticipating first? Peter Freeman turns. Doesn't get the shot. Minnie Keating. She does. What pony is Minnie riding? She's riding Army. Hell, she's going well on it. She is going at speed. Jimmy DeAngelis goes to the backhand. Doesn't get it. Sam Clements making a bad play there. He needs to get in behind or in front, but not beside Peter Freeman. He's going across the field now. Wants to back it into the middle. Minnie trying to get to it. Marco got it brilliantly. Marco picks it up. Marco coming towards the side. Now. Taps it again towards the middle. Doesn't gank enough. Dan gets just a touch on it. Minnie. Minnie. Ooh, she tried to turn it, but wasn't in control of stick or pony at that moment. So Jimmy DeAngelis now picks it up. She needs to get the hook here. She does. Dan Keating over the top of it. Leaves it for Matteo. Matteo didn't get quite the angle he wanted, but he's looking at goal now. He's going to tap it around. Keating tries to steal her off him. Doesn't do very well. Freeman gets a little back in. Sophie just gets a touch too. Big hook from uh, Jimmy DeAngelis on Sam. Doesn't really get the ball underway. Sophie now. Sophie goes for the big swing of a backhand. Didn't get it. Dan Keating trying to get it, but Mateo's got it. Mateo turns it. Peter can't get to it. Mateo's still got a chance. This is a real good chance for Italy now. The ball is running. <laughs> she's in, she's wide. Oh my goodness, no goals. And we've just under two minutes to go in this first chucker. What's next? Good pressure from the US for a while. It's a pretty even match at the moment. Unfortunately, I see the field digging up terribly. It's been obviously very wet after the last two weeks of rain. Minnie, can she pick it up? She can. She's over the halfway line. Sophie back there. Couldn't get the near side back yet. Minnie picks it up again. She's having trouble getting past Sophie. She doesn't get past Sophie. Now we've got Matteo. Backs it towards the middle. Keating tries to pick it up. It doesn't. This looks good for Sam Mike Clements right now. Just pushes it. Unfortunately, he pushed it right in front of Sophie. He does brilliantly. And she and Minnie now over on the far side. Minnie gets a little backhand. Turning quickly on that great pony is Sam Clements. Oh, he's done well. He, no, he did so well. He almost got past someone. Peter Freeman puts it up. Dan Keating, can he pick it up? He's going to have to do a tail backhand. This is a backhand behind the horse. He gets the tail backhand and it's between the posts. Wow, that's a difficult shot on its own without actually having that much accuracy. Keating opens the scoring with uh, 40 seconds to go. What 